and that's because I'm trying to keep my eyes on the mailman. I seen him swinging by here a couple of times and he ain't picked up my package yet. So I figured I better come out here <laughs> and just, you know, once I love when they pick up these packages and so forth. Uh, it leaves the stress off of me and all that. But anyway, we got this, all these beautiful handbags to share. Some of them that you have seen, some that you may not have seen. And uh, you know I don't like a long video, so I'm going to go ahead and get started, okay? Um, this one here is such a big, uh, beautiful uh, bag here. This is the Lulu Damar. And I just found out that Lulu Damar also does jewelry. I was watching um, one of the um, jewelry resellers um, do an unbagging or unboxing, whichever, and uh, they were showing uh, Lulu Damar jewelry. I said, what? <laughs> This is a beautiful bag here, leather, tweed leather, and that's one of the reasons I really got this uh, bag. I really love it. It's a nice, big, big tote. No damage to this bag. Straps are also tweed leather as well. And this bag doesn't have any hardware on it other than just the snap closure and so forth, which is just why I said this is just simple elegance here uh, and all that. Very nice, big tote and all that very nice big tote so yeah i like this bag and i'm actually surprised i still have this bag also these bags are kind of expensive and everything um but um yeah very clean and inside black fabric uh one zip lulu tamar logo and also uh two open pockets so you got one zip and two open pockets and all of this beautiful space inside, yeah. So that is Lulu Demar, our first bag. going to be a Rebecca Minkoff um, and this is the only large bag of Rebecca Minkoff I do have. I do have like a, uh, two small um, cross bodies and so far but this is such a luxury here. Uh, gray again pebble leather, uh, no damage to the bag. Uh, you do see Rebecca Minkoff down here. And I do like this bag because it's got this nice long side pocket here um, where you can put your stuff in on this side and everything. Very nice bag. It's got a lot of space there and everything. And this is a Rebecca Minkoff. And this is what is called a hobo style handbag. Shoulder bag. Okay. Yep. Rebecca Minkoff. The straps are great. I like the... um gunmetal hardware for hardware here and so forth and i like the way this bag is made now also too i guess you can use your different straps with this bag because it, you can like take these straps off so let me show you the inside okay again very clean in the inside um very clean and black fabric lining you got your uh zip and two open pockets uh you actually got four open pockets in this bag here you got a zip and two open pockets here then you got two open pockets on this side this is a nice bag very comfortable Um, I know every time I move, the sun is in and out here, so 
uh, not much I can do about that. But anyway, I'm glad that you're able to see these beautiful bags that I'm sharing with you. <laughs> but this is a Lucky Brand, and I love, love, love this bag because all of the details and so far. I did put these little white pieces here to keep these little flaps from sticking up and so far um, and all that. Uh, I do like all the buckle um, design and the um, brass hardware on here. Here is your logo, our lucky brand. Uh, this does have a zipper pocket on the back, also zip pocket on the front beautiful bag and also too this is also a crossbody where you can take this strap off but you cannot adjust it so this is your lucky brand nice leather nice soft leather i love this leather here and uh this is one of my favorite brand lucky uh lucky brand bag or lucky brand products actually it's one of my favorite this is a beautiful bag here Lucky brand that's no damage to the bag. Straps are really good. Brass hardware, gold. Um, removable crossbody straps. And then you got your shoulder straps, double straps. So let me show you the inside. Beautiful uh, brown lining, very clean. And this one does have a slew of pockets as well. You got two zip pockets on one side, and then you got another zip pocket over on this side, and two hardware, and so far. Hold on, guys. Okay, yeah, I've just seen the mailman, so I wanted to say a few things to him. I didn't want y'all to hear me hollering, because I will holler. If you don't act like you hear me, I will holler. Hello? Okay. Then that, but anyway, beautiful bag here uh, in the inside and everything. And a uh, lot of pockets and so forth for your good stuff and everything. Harley, won't I holler? Don't I holler at you all the time? Well, you're a bad dog, that's why. You're a bad dog. Don't even get up there messing, Harley. <laughs> And this is the Lucky Brand right here. Very nice bag. Uh, very nice leather. Very nice leather. Okay. So this is our third bag. Um, let's see. Okay. Pull from this side. Now this is such a cute little bag. I love the little flower details on this bag here. Um, look at all the print, the floral print and so forth. This is the sack root. Uh, here is the sack root logo right there. Um, and uh, you got your two zipper pockets here. Uh, zipper closure. And this is some kind of cloth strap and so forth. Very nice. It is adjustable so that you can wear this as a shoulder bag and then you got your back zipper pocket as well i actually love um crossbodies this time and i actually think crossbody is um some type of measurement of security <coughs> excuse me for women because you when you have your crossbody on and so forth um your hands are free um which is good and so for when you're shopping around and so forth and everything like that so i don't know this is what i think um which i don't do myself have a crossbody uh, around i still use use my big bag but i need to shop with other people as well okay this is the inside here of this bag here very clean and i do like that little um kind of beige gray and pink uh print here and so forth and this just has a zipper and two open pockets and this one here very nice bag though very nice and it holds all the good stuff and so far uh not everybody carries a lot in their handbags and so far uh not everybody does and um uh, and that's okay <laughs> you don't have to do carry a whole lot okay 
Now this is one of my favorite scores and of course um Ann Klein um products are still good, they're still selling, they still hold up the value and all that stuff, but they don't sell as much as they used to, of course, and so far. Uh, but the name still means something and they still sell. So this is a beautiful bag and I was not going to leave it behind that day that I got this or seen this bag and so far. This is some kind of I cannot give you the name of this material, uh, but it's not leather and it's not cloth. It's some concard uh, material, I think. I've heard uh, other handbag sellers pronounce it, but just what they pronounce it don't mean I can. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> and it's got leather trim in. This is a beautiful bag uh, here. Let's straighten it out a little bit. I do got bags in here to prevent wrinkles and things like that. This is Anne Klein, New York. Here is your logo right here and so forth. And this is a beautiful bag, actually. I love the um, material of this bag. You got your front pocket here. I love the material. And also, this is the way this bag looks. You got two snaps and one zip. So we're going to go with that and show you the inside there. Okay. Very, very clean um, brown material inside. And then on this other side, same thing. Very, very nice. This bag holds, holds a lot. And um, this looks like one of the nice classic um, shoulder bags and so forth. And uh, I definitely love this bag and so forth. Look how clean that is in the inside and so forth. And then you got your... Um, two open pockets here and a zip and then you got them all, all that space very nice bag very interesting bag very easy zipper pull as well looks like butter Very nice bag, very beautiful. I love the color too, that brown is hitting. Um, you know, brown, orange, and all those are great, great for this um, time of the year, traditional colors. Uh, although we do not go by that anymore. <laughs> People wear what they want to wear, which is okay, uh, color-wise that is, and so far. Um, I do and don't like sticking to traditional colors um, and so far, um, but I have to like something a lot, you know, to wear it kind of off or something like that. Okay, we got a couple parties to get out of the way, the handbag throwing around time. Okay, this is a cute little uh, clutch here. And shoulder bag here uh, from Kenneth Cole, um, Kenneth Cole Reaction. Now, I do love this little um, crock and box. I like the design of the opening so far where you do this. It's magnetic and all that. And um, inside this bag here, you can actually remove uh, the straps altogether or just fit them inside the bag and just carry it as a clutch like this here. So it's a very nice bag and it actually does hold quite a bit. So let me show you the inside. Have your hair, open space here. You do have a zipper part here, middle zipper. And then you do actually have two little small box, uh, things here as well. Okay. Okay, and then your magnetic closure there. Alright, don't even start it. 
we just seen the mailman drop off some mail and he like to bark of course all dogs do like to bark at the mailman for whatever reason i do not even understand <laughs> this is a tanganello and a cute cute little pebble um brown leather uh cross body i do really like this bag i like this little charm here a chunky charm here you can actually take this off and everything zip closure tanganella lay on um, come out of there on um, tanganella logo right here very nice little bag very nice and this bag is so pretty in the inside and you got this your nice uh zipper big zipper pocket here too in front and I, I believe it does hold cars. Uh, it does have a zipper here as well, two pockets. And then on this side, you got little car slots and so forth. So it's like a little wallet right here in this little statue, like a little wallet. And I just love, love, love um, this print uh, in this Tanganella. See how pretty that print is? Also, too, you got another zipper pocket here. Um, that is a Tanganella logo there. And then over on this side, you do have another open pocket. So this little bag is actually fully loaded. <laughs> it has got a lot going on for it and so far. So I definitely weren't leaving that behind either um, and all that. So this is the little Tanganello. Get this paper out of the way. Okay, now what? Oh, there we go. Here it says, What is You know we're not gonna have any parties. I know I keep going out dark, keep going out, and it come back in light and so forth. It's crazy. Oh, there it goes again. It's the cloud. It's keep changing. Okay, we're not gonna have any party as I was saying. Um without Michael Kors. This is a beautiful dark blue um navy tote. Uh, it does look black at some point uh, when you put it out, but it is actually blue. Beautiful bag with no damages at all. The straps are really great. Uh, I do have a back pocket here. This looks like a pocket, but it's not. Michael Kors logo here. Zip closure, of course. Now, I do see a lot of ladies with the Michael Kors totes. And I've been selling handbags for so long, I, it just like nature to me to just check out another woman's handbag. Like, what is she carrying? <laughs> you know what I mean? Just like jewelry um, today, because I'm back selling jewelry, not my handcrafted jewelry, but I'm back selling vintage and estate jewelry. Um, really, really high quality stuff. Now this right here is not high, high quality. This is a cute little Avon gold herringbone necklace here that I have on and I do have a little bracelet and so far that I'm selling with this and so far but I thought I'll put this on to show you so far because we don't have a mini jewelry haul today with these handbags and so far now there is a little uh discoloring on the feet of this bag and so forth but the bag itself is in great great shape so let me show you the inside Very clean, very nice, very big. Now this particular bag does not have all of the um, pockets that the other one does and so forth. This one has like one zip right here and then it has two open pockets over here. And that's basically what this bag has. Now some of the Michael Kors bag, I do have that black one in the room and so forth, has like five 
pocket. This one be nine. just have a couple more bags to share and then we will be done okay this is such a cute little bag uh, and I do still check the comps on it because it has not sold for me yet and so far but I do know that it is beautiful and this is Lulu Gunness, Guinness, whatever you want to call it, pronounce it, Lulu Gunness. Uh, very expensive little bag and so forth. Very cute, nice little bow. Kind of remind me of one of um, Betsy Johnson's bag with the bow. Uh, zip pockets in the back, hard um, hardware. And also you got patent leather trim with this bag and so far um yeah like i said i still do the comp on this bag every now and then and this bag is still uh, up there in the prices and so far although it is just a cute little bag um here on this side you do have it open i like that polka dot print again it reminds me of um betsy johnson's bag and then it'll snap open here right here another that open opening here um, and all that and then you got the main compartment zip compartment I just knew that this bag would be gone with you know gonna be when I got this bag I pictured it for like a young lady or student or something like that that would love to have this little bag around and so forth here you can see the actual print really better very clean in the side this bag is almost like new condition um got one pocket here and then you got uh i guess those other two pockets because that's nothing on that side and so forth and this is lulu uh guinness and it is very very cute little bag uh like i said cute little bag it is a little bag with you guys and so far and this is the um <laughs> steve madden weekender uh this here will house enough items for you for a weekend or week actually depending how you pack and all that so far this is the weekender a uh, nice big big tote Big tote. This is the weekend. I love the fact that they have a little bow on there. Very pretty. Very nice bag and so far. Um, you do got this big front pocket here uh, for a lot of items. And I love the print. And in the inside of the bag, you got this nice big pouch uh, for your um, utility. Uh, not utilities. Uh, uh, your health and beauty products and so far are uh, here uh, and then you also got this nice little um, zipper pocket here as well for cars change and things like that uh, and all that and a nice little pocket here for even your um, phone so it's got a lot in it and I love 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 this print let me just see if I can show you that is the print it is so pretty and it's just leather in the inside um, and all that. And this is your weekender. Yeah. Thank you guys for joining me today. And I appreciate it and so forth. So glad uh, that you was able to get into another section of the house uh, to see these handbags. Maybe see them even better and so forth. And then 
uh, in my workroom because it is usually a little bit darker in there and so far. But anyway, I'm just glad I was able to go ahead and share these handbags with you. Uh, if you're interested in any of these handbags or see what jewelry or other items that we do have on our website is www.ebay.com slash str slash chalze, S-H-A-W-Z-A-E, books and home decor. Also, check out our Etsy, uh, www.etsy slash, oh, etsy.com slash shop slash shaw, S-H-A-W, vintage shop, and all that. So, check out those two websites and so forth and everything and see what we do have.